But hey, welcome back. It's been a while. I'm excited to get started. Um, I'm excited to play Fields of Mystery. It's been a while. I hope everything is going okay. I hope everything's recording okay. I hope things are capturing okay. I do have a different mic as well, so I might need to tweak some settings, but we'll see. Everything seems to be working okay. I've got got my OBS up here. I'm checking. It's telling me things are okay. So we'll see. So cute, so cozy. So excited to play Fields of Mystery. Like, it is... I say a little bit unreal. It's probably not. But it has been everywhere. Um, so, yeah. I initially didn't want to play this. I'll be honest, the artwork kind of put me off a little bit to begin with. Not the artwork, but the gameplay artwork put me off. So I was kind of like, nah, not interested, not my cup of tea. And then I saw it all over TikTok and actually fell in love with the game, fell in love with some of the mechanics and was like, we're playing that tonight, boys. So I'm super excited to, to get started. And let's get in to some cozy farming. I'm so ready for this. It just looks so adorable. I can't wait. So cute, so cute, so cute. Still working, sis? I still, I also don't know who I'm going to romance yet. I've got like, I've seen a handful of options, so we'll have to see. Oh, Eland? Island? I'm going to go with Eland. It's probably wrong, but we're going with it. Didn't realise how late it had gotten. She's cute. She's an option for romancing, just an FYI. Thought you could use a nice hot cup of coffee. Mmm, coffee. That'd be nice. Thank you. Ah, cute. So, how's the time revitalization plan coming along? It's nearly there, I think. Catalog the earthquake's damage, listed out the various repairs necessary, and even made plans to replenish our emergency stockpile by the end of summer. Damn! She working on it. She she doing it. The only thing we're missing now is the help to see it through. Wonder where they're gonna get that from. With mother and father called away to the capital, and people leaving after the earthquake were certainly there. Certainly are fewer helping hands around. Only we could attract new villagers to move here. I wonder how they'll do this. Hmm. Mystery is such a beautiful place. The small town charm, the rich history of the area, the rolling farmland. That's it. The old farm south of town. Why don't we send a notice to the Adventurers Guild in the capital? Surely someone out there will agree to aid the town in exchange for land with such potential. That's a great idea. I'll get started on it. Thank you, Eland. I wonder who will answer the call. Who indeed. Oh, the pressure though. I have to name myself and my farm. <laughs> the pressure. Um, okay, name, I guess. I guess I'll just go my name. I've also seen so many cute uh, customizations uh, for different characters and I don't know what I'm gonna go for because I've seen I've seen a lot of cute things um, she her I can pick my birthday well my birthday typically is in the summer Ooh, uh, I wanted to be a little Halloween baby let's go like the middle of fall let's be a little spoopy babe Mist Grove Farm. I kind of like that again. I never know what to call my farms in these. Even in Stardew, I never know. I I normally go for this. I normally go for Lon Lon Ranch. And if you know where that's from, good on you. Confirm. Pets are not available yet. This is still early access. Um, so obviously there's gonna be potentially a lot of changes and things so lots of things to come what hair do we want I want something long because look how freaking cute it all is uh, 
I think I like this with the little fringe. I think this kind of is similar-ish to what I have. Um, I kind of want to go for a purple because purple is my fave colour. Uh, let's go for like a cute light purple like that. That, oh yes. Oh, see this? This right here, I have seen so many TikToks of people with this little bandana. And, oh, it's so cute. I just, it's so cute. And I want to do it, but everybody does it. So I kind of want to go for something different. Um, oh, we can have a little hijab. Oh, that's cute. Oh my gosh. Stop. This is freaking adorable. What is this? Ribbon. Oh, that is cute. A little bow. A little witch's hat. I kind of, I think I'm going to go for the beret. But I kind of want to go for like a little pastel pink. Uh, skin tone I think is fine. Eyes I think are fine. We'll maybe have, maybe do little blue eyes. Um, we have a little blush. We have a little blushy moment. Oh, yes. That is cute. Kind of feel like because of the pixels, it sticks out a little too much, though. I don't know. I think we'll go without blush for now. We can always change it because, again, I've seen that you can, like, set up your outfit. So you can have your outfit, save this as an outfit, and then you can quickly go in and change it, which I love. Uh, I really kind of want to keep this dress, but again, I've seen everybody do this dress, so I want to do something different. I just want to be different, guys. Okay. Ooh, dungarees, though. That is cute. Cute little dress. Have a little, oh, a little cropped top. That's cute. What is this? Oh, pants. Oh, okay, cute, cute. Yeah, I think, I think for me the dungarees win. Oh, and I do quite like, quite like this one. I think we'll go for this one. Uh, ooh, we can choose like a cape? What? Or a backpack? Wow. Incredible. Let's do some cute little boots. Okay. Let's go. Let's start. Ooh, I've seen a lot about Valor as well. Hello there, General Kenobi. Uh, oh yeah, and can't we jump in this game as well? That's pretty nifty that we can jump. I'm pretty sure we can anyway. Didn't expect to see anyone else out this way. The roads have been a real mess since the earthquake. I'm Bala, a travelling merchant. Pleased to meet you. Let me guess. You're here at Lady Adeline's request. She mentioned someone had taken up her up on her offer. She said she was looking for a capable adventurer. There was something about free land and a house. To be fair, that would be me. I'd be like, free land? I'm there. I've seen the area. It's a lovely spot, quite close to town. I'll walk with you the rest of the way, if you don't mind the company. No wagons can get through since the bridge collapsed, so I've had to carry what I can on foot. Oh, what a sweetie. Great, let's go. Oh my god, are you going to make me hop over this? Because I will die. Okay, thank goodness it's a cutscene. I was like, don't make me jump over this, because I will be in the water. You. We should be able to make it before it gets dark. Come on, head straight to your new farmstead. Yes, please. Take me to Lon Lon Ranch. Oh. <laughs> See, now that I'm like in the game playing it, the gameplay like art style looks really cute. And I don't know why I was so, not against it, but why I didn't like it before because it's so cute. <laughs> Uh, Lord Eland, look who I find out at the edge of the forest. 
Gemma, I presume. Welcome, welcome. I'm Eland. It's wonderful to meet you. You're in good hands, Gemma. I'm off to the inn. It's been a long day and I need a hot meal. I'll see you around. See you. I don't think Bala's a marriage candidate for me. He's... He's tempting, but I think he's a no, unfortunately. So, what do you think? Nice, isn't it? You're right outside of town. Great soil for farming. And look at this house. Four stacked walls with a rich history. Let's go inside, shall we? Yes, let me see my new house. I'm so excited. Oh, and everything's running smoothly. Hooray. Wow, look at my beautiful home. Isn't it just fabulous? The queen hath returned. Well, I doubtful about the queen, but I hath returned. Uh, just a minute. She's so freaking cute, man. She's definitely, I think, in, in the runnings. Her, I think I've seen a doctor that's really cute. And uh, someone that lives that away on the map to us as well. It uh, appears we're not quite ready for you. But not to worry. I'm sure she'll only need a moment. Should we go in and help? I'm used to roughing it, honestly. Uh, I'll be honest, I'm the should we go in and help type person. No need. She's finished. Aha. Alright, chill out. I do still need a house to live in. Just saying. You must be Gemma. I'm Adeline. Thank you so much for answering my request. Oh, cute. My brother and I are so excited to have a real adventurer here to help the town. I also feel like there needs to be a drinking game. Every time I say, ah, oh, cute for this game, I feel like you need to take a shot because you'll be wasted within like two seconds. Hope you like your new farm. Has a lot of potential, don't you think? Yeah. Why don't you come inside? Let me in. I want to see. Oh, cozy! I was, I was gonna say, I was gonna go. Oh, cute, cozy. Glad you think so. Would you like a quick tour of the room? Uh, yeah, sure. I've not played this before, so why not? I know there's stuff with this, and I'm assuming this is a calendar, but still. Let's have a look. This here is your diary. You can write in it when you want to record your story. Ah, that was what people were talking about. I'd seen that, unlike Stardew, where you have to go to bed to save, you can just save in that book, which, yes, I, I do kind of prefer that. And this, of course, is your new bed. Make sure you go to sleep by 2am each day to keep your stamina up. Okay, 2am, that's like Stardew. That's cool. Also put this calendar up for you. You can use it to check when Mystria holds its festivals and check when everyone's towns everyone <laughs> everyone's town's birthday. Everyone in town's birthdays are. And this storage chest here was made by Mystria's very own carpenter, Reese. You can store items here if your bag starts to get too full. And that's about it for your tour. Question, can I light the fire? Because I do like a cozy fire. I well, you might be hungry when you got here, so I stopped by the inn and picked up a bowl of their famous vegetable soup. Well, I'm sure you're worn out from your long day. We won't keep you up. Welcome to Mystery, Gemma. We're so glad to have you. Let's meet up tomorrow so we can start discussing our plans for the town restoration. Yay, I'm excited to be here. Look at my little house. Oh, it's so cozy. And off to sleep. Sleep, sleep. And we're in. Oh my goodness. Oh, I might have to move maybe my camera. Just because you, well, I don't know if you really need to see my energy. My energy bar's up the top there. Um, so I might need to move that, but we'll see. We'll see how we go. Um, okay, so interact is right click. Spring festival. Bala, Eland, me. Ooh, Adeline's a, she's a winter girl. Yeah, winter girly. 
anything exciting? No. Just a worn sword. A worn but still serviceable sword used to cut grass and fight if necessary. Neat. Okay. <gasps> yes, I can light the cozy fire. Yes. <laughs> Let's go have a look at our farm. Oh, it's the main girl, Celine. Ah, hello, you must be Gemma. I'm Celine. So nice to meet you. I live in the cottage north of here. So excited that we'll be neighbours. In fact, I brought you a little housewarming, uh, field warming present. Here's a hoe. You'll need it to till your fields. I love gardening myself, so I had this extra one laying around. If you want to expand your field size, though, you'll need a shovel. They're available at my family's general store. Okay. So I'm guessing we need to shovel the grass, then we can home. Shovel, then home. Got it. There are three bags of tulip seeds to get you started. Our store also carries a selection of other seeds, so be sure to stop by. Maybe you'll consider growing lots of flowers. Uh, yes, I do kind of want to grow lots of flowers. I'm normally a crop girly when it comes to like Stardew, but I think with how cute this game is, it's going to be flowers as well. Oh, I'm so glad, you know, Mistria has a rich horticultural history. <laughs> Here he is. Here's the other marriage candidate I was on about. Hayden. Heck yeah. Morning, neighbour. The name's Hayden. I run Sweetwater Farm to the west. You don't gotta tell me your name, Gemma. You're already the talk of the town. Hayden, you almost galloped straight into poor Gemma. It's fine. Ah, uh, don't mind my horse. He just likes meeting new folks as much as I do. <laughs> it's fine. Pleasure's all mine. I think I need to lie down. <laughs> well, uh, pleasure's all mine. Farmer after my own heart. Here, I bought you a little something. Take this watering can. You'll need to water your crops every day if you want to make them grow big and strong. And here, three bags of turnip seeds. Turnips are good raw and they're even better cooked. The whole time will surely appreciate more shipments of fresh produce. Heck yeah. It's been a good while since I've been out here. Things have always things sure have gotten overgrown. You need any pointers on getting started with your field? Uh sure, why not? Step one, use your hoe on cleared field areas to till the soil. Plant seeds. Water them. Harvest! Shovel from the general store when you want to expand your fields. Oh, I've seen people do really cute heart fields as well, and I don't know if I kind of want to do that for flowers because it does look really cute. Sell, cook, or even feed crops to your animals. That's pretty nifty. I like that we can feed them to animals. That's cool. Don't be shy. Come by any time if you want to chat. Love to introduce you to all my animals. Sure you must be eager to meet up with Adeline. Just head north of here and the road will take you right into town. You got it! First, I want to plant my stuff. Let me at it. Let me at the field. Um. Uh, slice? This one. Yes. Fibre. Why we made a plant material using a variety of crafting recipes. So we haven't got a pickaxe or a axe yet, so we can't clear some of this away, which is kind of annoying because ideally I'd want to start on this row, but it's fine. It is what it is. So we've got three and three, so. Ooh, okay. Three and let's do this. Keep them a little bit separate. Well, plant your bad boys there. And are you a bad boys up there. And uh, we're gonna do a little water. A verb. Do I need to refill my watering can? I don't think I do. I think it just refills automatically, like it just does. It just is. Can I have these? No, what is this? It's a bug. I can't catch it. I don't have a net. Let's head north and see what we can find. Let's have empty hands just so that we can we've got empty hands. So we are here. Head into town. Wow, look at all these people. 
Oh my goodness, so many people. Ah, uh, okay, cool. Nifty. I like that it shows where people are on the map as well. That is a very helpful. When I play Stardew on the PC, that is a mod that I do really like, is when you can see NPCs on the map. Uh, nice. Stuff time rank wood. Ooh. So can we only reach this level in early access or is it just blocked off because we just can't get to them at the moment? Equipment? Wow. Okay. There's so many things. Here. Yeah, we can add little preset outfits and that's adorable. Um, I would like to delete one though, please. Uh, gee. Yeah, that's cute. I like that we can do that. Uh, no active quest. Ooh, this is cute, Celine. Island, Hayden, single. So many people. Uh, we got no animals, no magic, and absolutely nothing here. Apparently, we have one fish. Which is fiber. Fiber is now a fish. Got it. Okay. Okay, enough getting distracted. Let's go. Let's head into town and see people. Town south, long, long range. Lone, lone range. Can I shake the tree? I can. Dandelion. Must be the last one of the season. Wildflower that grows in spring, sometimes used in cooking. Nice. Uh, I think we can also... Ooh. I think we can also donate it to the museum. I think that's what that little icon means. Um, oh, where is my stuff there? Yeah, that little symbol I think means that we can donate it to the museum whenever we get there, wherever that is. Um, so that's that's nice. Is this berries? Did we find some berries? Did we find some berries? I think I found my berries. Small berries are forest in spring and using a variety of cooking recipes. I feel like I also need to put in like a how many vines and memes can I fit into one like video? A little shop, Bala's wagon, sheep wall. Dude, these are expensive. I have 50 coins. So stiff hairs dropped. Okay. Hey. Hey. Shining green gem and a Kali Pella. Wow. Okay. Oh, I think my mouse is slowly on the fritz because it's changing down here and I'm not touching the mouse wheel or my number pad, so. Uh, hi. How are things on the farm? Is that all then yet? Remember, I'm just up the road if you need an extra pair of hands. Thanks. Can I go inside your house? Oh, I can. Oh, my goodness i am so ready to decorate <laughs> whether it's gonna be as good as this questionable but i am ready i think anyway i'm always really bad when it comes to like decor and stuff like in the sims and stuff i'm like okay it's not too bad uh, I'm gonna collect some more fiber because you never know it's always handy I always remember in Stardew I the first ever time I played it I always remember collecting loads of fiber and then I sold it all and then I needed it for loads of recipes and was very upset so <laughs> collect everything hoping I'd run into you your timing is perfect I'm sure you're eager to start helping Mishri and its citizens so I'm here to tell you about our town's request board come with me as the name implies, villagers post their requests here every day. You receive rewards whenever you complete them. It's a great way to earn money, equipment, and most importantly, renown. Renown? What's that? 
Ah, yes, let me explain the basics. Please do. Tiny baby. As you know, Mistria is just one of the many towns that make up the kingdom of Alderia. <laughs> this was the, the wrong kind of game for someone who's potentially slightly dyslexic to have. <laughs> but anyway, Alderia, all of them uh, receive a town rank according to their renown level. Hey, Peppy Rage, what a cutie. Uh, Adeline is definitely a cutie. Adeline would be someone that I... She's in the potential running for romance option at the moment. Towns with a higher town rank enjoy more popularity and more support from the capital. Mistria's renown level. Mistria's renown level was improving prior to the earthquake. Since then, though, we're down two entire town ranks. As daughter and heiress of Mistria's baron, improving this situation is my highest priority. With your help, we'll repair the earthquake's damage, raise Mistria's town rank, and put this village back on the map. Why don't you go ahead now and accept your first request? It's one I put up just for you. Thanks. Oh no, it's one of these. I don't like these. They're so annoying. I know it like gets you like gets you used to the map, you get to meet everybody, but I just hate it. I just don't I don't like it. I'm sure you've met some of your neighbours already. Uh, wouldn't it be nice to say hello to everyone? Don't be shy, introduce yourself. Introduce yourself to all the townsfolk and then talk to Adeline. Luckily though, in this game, our map can help us with where everyone is. So we've met five out of 22 people and then we get potatoes and money. We'll take it. Perfect, that was easy, right? I'm sure you want to meet your new neighbours as much as they want to meet you. And as you get to know them better, your journal can keep track of your relationship with them and document their favourite gifts. <gasps> and what are you like, Adeline? Hint, hint, nudge, nudge. Turnips are nice. They're in season right now. I hope you'll be growing some on your farm. Uh, yes, I will. You can view the map in your journal. Should give you a good idea of where people are. Isn't that helpful? And each time you meet someone, it will update. I'm so glad that we can do that. You can think of this as the first step on your path to restoring the town. Isn't it exciting? Come talk to me when you're done meeting everyone. Okay, let's go! I have no idea where to go first. Uh, right. Let's, I guess let's go in here first. Hello, everybody. Hi, Balor. Glad I bumped into you. Forgotten to mention. Make sure that you put anything that you want to sell into the shipping bin next to your house. I'll pick up your shipments and leave your payment overnight. Jobs in this town depend on the stock I, pro I procure for them, so we're looking forward to your business. Who are you? Nora! You must be Gemma. Welcome to Mistria. I'm Nora. I run the general store in town with my husband and our daughters. Also, head of the Chamber of Commerce and the Saturday Market. So, unfortunately, the Saturday Market has been on hiatus since the earthquake caused the bridge in town to collapse. Bala is currently the only merchant that even attempts the trip these days, and he has to do all that on foot. Uh, broken bridge? Maybe I can help. Oh, right. Adeline did mention you'd be helping the town in exchange for the farm. If the broken bridge were repaired, all sorts of merchants could resume bringing their wares to town on Saturdays. You'd love it. Anyway, if you need anything in the way of seed supplies, please stop by the store anytime. Thanks. Oh god, I hadn't decided if I was going to do mouse and keyboard or controller, because I'm not used to mouse and keyboard sometimes. So we'll see whether I stick with it, but it is easy that I can just like zoom zoom with the mouse. Potatoes, we've got cabbage, we've got strawberries, daffodils, tulips, cherry sapling, a lemon sapling, a walt. And we got cute little decorations. Our wheelbarrow is cute. Okay, we can get some tools from here. Nice, nice. What was this bag upgrade? Oh. That's a lot of muns, but in comparison to Stardew upgrade, I don't think it's a lot of muns. Sugar, flour, rice, rock salt, oil, paper, curry powder. Uh, 
Uh, can we go back here? Can we see who went back this way? Mm. Wow, this is adorable. Holt. Well, hello there. You must be the new face in town. Nice to meet you. I'm Holt. I'd be wondering who'd move into that old farm. Oh, wow. I'm pleased to meet you too. Yes. Let's dad joke him back. That's a good one. Anywho, my wife Nora and I run the general store. Our girls Celine and Del help out as well. Stop by if you ever need supplies. Don't mind me, just walking into all of your guys' bedrooms. Any like... Oh there, collection of Holt's hand carved wooden figures. They're very cute. Speaking of this book feels that it's Holt's punning journal. You put it down quickly. Nah, read that bad boy. Get some hints. Ooh, okay. Cute room. Wall shelves display an impressive, impressive collection of cool rocks and sticks. Is Holt? Is Holt a doggo? Does a doggo have his own room? Because if so, that's pretty cool. I'm not gonna lie. Cozy blanket fort guarded by a dog plushie. You watch their child's actually gonna turn out to be like seven or something, and I've just insulted them by being like, is it a dog? Eh? Is it a child a dog? Okay, so we met you guys. Let's go into the next place. Hemlock! Who do we have here? Are you the new farm everyone's been talking about? Great to meet you, I'm Hemlock. If you ever need a good meal, a cold drink, or some good company, be sure to stop by the Steeping Dragon Inn. There's always a cauldron of hearty soup kept hot for anyone who wants a bowl. Nice, good to remember. So we can buy all sorts of food here. Nice. Interesting. Uh, coffee mug, ooh, okay. Buy little decorative mugs. Recipes. Drinks. Okay. Cool, cool. Cool, cool. Celine. I work part time at the general store. I hope you stop by when you can. And who are you? Oh, she's cute. Oh, hello. You must be the new farmer. My name is Reina. My family owns the Sleeping Dragon Inn. It's a pleasure to meet you. So, what brings you to Mistra, if you don't mind me asking? Always dream of starting my own farm. I heard there was free land up for grabs. Uh, it's like a mixture of both, I guess. We'll go with the top one. That's so lovely. I'm excited to see what types of produce you'll grow. Same, I'm so ready. Have a passion for food, especially when it's locally sourced. Well, I hope to stop by and try my cooking sometime. I'll be looking forward to it. Thanks. Can we get some soup? Today's flavour is corn chowder. Ooh. Yeah, I don't really think I've got the inventory room for it. Oh, I just eat it anyway. Oh, okay. Nifty. I just come and eat. And it refills my energy. Cabinet is full of glassware and various bottles. Empty mason jar features a worn and peeling label which reads, Bees, do not touch. Oh no, someone released the bees. <laughs> Josephine, hello there. Well, you must be our new farmer. Adlai mentioned you'd be arriving soon. Delighted to meet you. You can call me Josephine, though I also go by Joe. Some people normally do the other around. They they're like, you can call me Joe, but my name is the. <laughs> but hey, you do you, honey. I run the Stephen Dragon Inn with my husband Hemlock and our children Raina, Maple, and Luke. Have you met them all yet? Stop by any time, dear. You're always welcome, whether you need a meal or just want a chat. It'd be my pleasure to serve up either. Rafting. Uh, I think you've mistaken me for someone with much more experience, game. Handcrafted, wow. Craftable, nothing. <laughs> wow, so many things. Uh, one, I'm like excited that there's so many things, but at the same time I'm like, there's too many things, bro. Eden, swing by my farm whenever you like. The animals are friendly and they love meeting new people. Oh, but it's no rush. I'm sure you've got plenty to do, what with getting the lay of the land here in Mistria. Ooh, Hayden. Do you like my character already? Is that what you're trying to say? 
the door is locked. Uh, oh, oh, all of them aren't locked. <laughs> I hope there's no guests in here. Just like, don't mind me coming in. What's this? Can I read anything? Ooh, Raina's recipe book. It's full of handwritten recipes. Oh, that's cute. She has her own little, like, Tesca gem. The smell of citrus lingers in the air. That's cute. Raina? So, this is going to be one of the other children. Oh, this is a cool room. Drawing of a Prince Rabbit rendered in coloured pencil. Prince Rabbit and Duke Frog oversee Queen Maple's room. Yes, they do. Marconi's bear sits plotting next to Maple's toy chest. Gonna waste all of my time just looking in people's rooms instead of actually talking to people. Derma Fetra and Dite Diff Diff Again, should not have given this game to me. <laughs> because can I read? No. Small terrarium sits on top of the bureau. It's a variety of cute bugs living inside. <gasps> Did she have the bees? Who released her bees? Bugnet. Oh, Luke, sorry. Uh, you're probably not powerful enough to wield it, no. I am not powerful. <gasps> you do. Yes, stop. Let me speak to you. Hi, are you the new farmer? My name's Maple. Where did you live before you came here? Have you ever been to the capital? That's where the royal family lives, you know. You can ask me anything. I know a lot about them. Luke, hello. Do you like bugs? Uh... Not really, but sure. Yeah. Excellent. My name's Luke. I'm so excited to have a fellow insect enthusiast in town. Finally. Wait until I tell my sisters. Uh, nice to meet you too, Luke. Don't mind me. Just barging into this room. Ooh, fancy room. Is this parents' room, I'm guessing? Yeah, Hemlock's bureau. Cosmetics and accessories sit on Josephine's. Okay, nice. So, who else? So that's everybody in here. Ooh, there's one person in here we haven't met, so we'll go back across the road and meet them. They must have snuck on in while I was talking to people. Who's here? Answer me! Or can I not meet them because this is in the way? <gasps> no, I can! Yes! No, I don't. I don't care about the dollhouse. Cool. Glad they're decorated with faded wallpaper. Speak, Dell. Hello, are you the one moving into the old farm? I'm Dell. That place is haunted, you know. Haunted with monsters. I swear, I saw one hiding behind a tree. Let me know if you've any trouble, and I can take care of them for you. Thanks. I'm pretty sure me with my little sword can do more damage, but just, just. Uh, okay, there was someone down this way, it said. Like, by the river. Okay, so I'd have to go out of town and back. That might be kind of worth it. Just to grab them while they're there, before they leave. Uh, excuse me, I need to meet you. Hello. Terathea. Hi there, I'm Terathea, and who might you be? Ah, that's right. Adeline mentioned her plan a while back. Didn't realise someone had taken her up on it. I run a little tackle shop out by the beach. I sell fishing rods and a small selection of freshly caught fish. Feel free to stop by. Thanks. What's this way? More berries. Uh, thank you. Oh, what is this? Can I have this? No. I can't have that. Not yet. Maybe I need, like, a scythe in order to cut those. Okay, let's head back up into town and go and find some more people to meet. So there was people over here. Hello, are you still here? The clinic! Oh, <gasps> yes, yeah, she's the other candidate that I'm very excited to meet. Valen. 
No, you must be the new farmer. Gemma, isn't it? Me? I'm the town's doctor. I run our clinic. No need for formalities, though. You can just call me Valen. Uh, it's nice to meet you, Valen. You too. I hope you're getting settled in alright. Running a farm is hard work. Be sure that you get plenty of sleep and eat well to keep your energy up. What do you sell? Okay, so I can get different tonics here. Restores health, stamina. That's a buff for the day. Ooh, interesting. That's a buff that gives you a two-hour boost on speed. And two-hour health and stamina regen effect. Ooh, okay. Nifty nifty. Can I go in your basement? It's locked. Val and let me in your basement. Oh, now this is the like colour palette that I like. She definitely, she's she's shooting up to the top right there. Bookshelf is filled with medical journals and mystery novels. Nice. Okay, who else have we got? Uh, okay, so we need to go out of here, up into like the main square, and then there's two. I see a doggo. I'm very excited about this doggo looking shape right here. Oh my god, it is so late. It's already 7pm. We gotta hurry. We gotta meet all the people. Uh, this was the one with the doggo. Yes, most important. Hi. Hey, Juniper. Yes, I'm the newcomer. Is that right? Well, you can call me Juniper. Recently opened the one and only bathhouse in this backwater village. Uh, I wouldn't call it a backwater village, but, you know, each to their own. What's a lady like you doing in a place like this? A backwater bathhouse, eh? Uh, what's a lady like you doing in a place like this? Well, like you, I have my own reasons for being here. Anyway, please stop in often. By the look of it, you could certainly use it. Ugh, rude. That's just rude. There was me, you're a lovely lady, and you're there like, you could use it, you skank. <gasps> Dozy. Miss Collar says Dozy. To meet you, Dozy. He wags his tail. Oh, I pet him! So cute. Dozy looks apologetic that he didn't have enough. Heresy? Tessere? Tessere? For the bar. Tessere. Let's go with Tessere. This sounds fun. Tessere! Wow. If this doesn't scream magical Sailor Moon. Go. I don't know what does. I take it that's because it turned 8pm. All night book lays open on Juniper's desk. Legend of the Forgotten Queens. Recent discoveries in Western Aldaria suggest a line of ancient queens that may have ruled the area prior to the Dark Ages. Let's have a little look. I feel like my stuff isn't registering on OBS. I need to have a look at that because... It's not pulling up anything. I'm looking over and I'm like, yep, cool. It's telling me info, but it's not pulling through that said info. So um, if I miss anything, I do apologize. It's not intentional. My OBS just isn't notifying me of it. So that's something that I need to look back at doing again. Um, but I couldn't remember. It was such a long time that I streamed. I couldn't remember how everything's set up on OBS. So I just kind of was like... I think it all works. We'll find out when we stream. So I have to reset everything up um, just to check. But I think I have a new follower. So I'm very thankful for whoever that was. Very grateful. I'm very sorry that I missed it. Oh, hi. Sorry, I didn't know you were behind me. Ulrich. Whoa, are you the new farmer everyone's been talking about? The one who's come to help out the town? That's super cool. Nice to meet you. Name's Ulrich. My brother and I live at the blacksmith's. I hope we can be friends. Now, your brother is someone that I've seen a lot about on TikTok. He's not specifically for me, to be honest. But I, I kind of see why people like him. The name's March. What do you want? Uh, hi, I'm the new farmer. 
don't see what that has to do with me. Regardless of what Adeline says, we really don't need an outsider to come in and solve our problems for us. I, uh, We have everything under control. Just don't get in the way. Oh, March. You silly boy. Okay, so we can get tools here. We can get upgraded armor. And we can buy copper and stuff here. Okay. Noish, noish, noish. So, we met those guys. Okay, there's two people up there. Uh, then is that everybody? No, even after we meet those two up there, up north, we still have two more people to meet. Uh, so I'm guessing this is Adeline's parents then, because she said she was like the Baron's daughter. So I'm guessing this is her parents. But the house is so freaking huge. I was going to say, where are they? There they are. That was not as difficult as I thought it was going to be. Hi, don't mind me. Uh, hello there, are you the new farmer everyone's been talking about? I hear you'll be helping to raise a mysterious renown. How splendid. Seems we share a common goal. You can call me Errol. I'm the cura cura <laughs> curator of Mysteries brand new museum. Hope you'll consider donating some items. You mean like my hands? <laughs> I've made that joke before and it's such a lame joke. I'm so sorry to subject you to that. It's a great way to earn renown. You'll even receive rewards for each collection you complete. Let's support each other's efforts for Mystria. I'll be rooting for you. Thanks. Uh, it looks like a mix between Stardew Valley and the cast reminds me of Minish Cap. It does a little bit. I've seen people dub it as kind of... Um, like a mix between kind of Studio Ghibli meets a farming game, which I do kind of get, but... Oh my, now who do we have here? That's a nice name, thanks. My name is Elsie. I live at the manor house with my niece and nephew, Adeline and Eland. Their parents, the Baron and Baronesses, spend most of their time in the capital, especially these days. I once did too, but grand times, but spending time in mystery, you really start to appreciate living in the country. Well, be sure to stop by for a chat anytime, dear. I can share the latest gossip and even some romantic advice if you need it. Uh, yes. How do we abort Daddy Hayden? That's what I want to know. What does Daddy Hayden like? Uh, okay. Who are we missing? Um, nobody that way. Anybody further up? No. There. Someone in Hayden's house. And is that everyone then? No, because then that'll only be 21 out of 22. Hmm. Is there going to be someone like the next day that's going to show up? Is it going to be kind of like Stardew where someone's just going to rock up one day and be like, ha ha, hi. About the blacksmith. Uh, I've completely forgot where I was heading. I just started running in a direction and hoped for the best. I think we go across then down. Or oh, Hayden's farm. Uh, North Museum and the summit. Mines, Western Ruins. Okay, yeah, southwest. That's where we need to go. Can we, is the museum open? I know I need to go home, but there's just so many things. Donate. Let's donate the dandelion. Nice. Okay, close. So many stuff. Wow, okay. So much stuff. Wowie. This is definitely, when people were saying this was like a Stardew, Animal Crossing, like, crossover, I definitely see what people mean. So many things. Okay, right, let's get a move on. Let's start to make our way back home and hopefully we don't pass out on the first day. I don't know if there's any consequences for passing out in this game. Like, do you get energy or, like, money taken off of you like you do in Stardew? Uh, I guess we'll see. So we need to head this way and then this way direction. It's 12.40. We should have enough time, I 
I think. I feel like I've also just completely missed Hayden's farm. Um, yeah, because now I'm down here, so we need to head to our farm, then head west. But we might have to wait until the next in-game day because it's 1am. We gotta go to bed. Gotta go sleep. Can I see what's behind here? No. Okay, good night, my crops. Let's... Uh, I don't want to sell all of it. I want to... I want to take, like, a half. Yeah, that'll do. Because, again, you never know when you're going to need some of this stuff. So, that'll do. Sell some of those, and then... Put those in there. And sleep. Yes. Sleep, sleep. Night one completed. So we sold 12 things at $1 each. Uh, we donated something. Oh, that's nice. We get money for donating stuff. That's pretty cool. And then, so then that just gives us a summary of what we sold. Oh, and that's cute that you can turn that on and off. That's really adorable. Okay. Next day. I feel like the more I'm playing this, the more I'm loving every aspect of this. Spring day do. I don't know how many days we'll get through in this stream. Um, today I'm kind of hoping to stream for about two-ish hours. So we'll see how many days we get through. Um, okay. So we need to head over to Hayden and meet you. I, it says I've met you two, but I don't... You, I recall, you're the um, the beach lady. I don't know who you are. No, you're the beach lady, so who are you? Okay, there's nobody up that way. Nobody that way. If I go down... No, I can't go across one. So that's everybody there. There. Okay, they're in that shop right now. So, let's head to Hayden's, then let's head into town. <gasps> a mushroom! I want to pick it! Let me pick that mushroom! Ah, good morning. When I was here the other day, I noticed something stupendous about this tree. I believe it is covering old stonework. As head of the historical society, I thought I'd investigate, but this old bark is proving to be surprisingly tough. Uh, it's awful early for this kind of thing. If someone was coming around my house at like six in the morning knocking down a tree, I'd tell them to bugger off. Terribly sorry, it's been on my mind and I just had to investigate. How about I make you an honorary member to make amends? Okay, I guess. I think I need a moment. Uh, let me take a swing at it. Oh, by all means, here, you can have my axe. And my bow. One worn axe. Heck yeah, show him how strong you are. Heck yeah. It's a statue of Caldrus, the mythical, mythological guardian of Mystria. Our ancient ancestors used to worship statues like this one. What an incredible find. Shame about the head, but with a little help from the newest member of the historical society, I think we can see him as good as new. If you would. There we are. Don't you just love that sense of achievement? I believe that reconnecting with Mystery's past is the key to our future. This has been a most productive morning. Thank you for all your help. Please keep the axe and do let me know if you stumble on anything intriguing. If you stumble upon any intriguing archaeological finds yourself. Nice. Warm but still serviceable axe. Okay, I want to go here. I want to put the soup there. there. Yes. Statue has a dignified present. It almost seems alive. It's alive! Can I... Can I not pick you? Can I hoe you? No. I want it so bad. 
Curator of the of Mysteries Museum, I'm delighted to share that we have unveiled a series of tiered rewards to encourage donations to our collection. Please stop by the museum uh, west of Tyne at your earliest convenience. Nice. Okay, we can do that. Uh, let's break some of these. I would scroll through these at the bottom, but like I said, I think my mouse wheel is slightly defunct. <laughs> because it does this and I'm scrolling and um, yeah so um, I know it's a bit of a pain to click down but it'll be fine I will survive for now nice give me that wood give me that wood Fresh noise and water my crops can I stand in the middle and just oh yes look at that optimization just stand there and click. Perfect. Okay, so we've got to head west. So we can go see who's at Hayden's and go to the museum. Oh, the cute little seesaw. Hayden's coop. This must be where his small animals live. Aiden's barn. This must be where the large animals live. Lady Maple welcomes you to Mistria and accepts tribute in the form of cash or snacks. I thought she was going to do like a Hunger Games reference and was like, accept you as tribute. And I was like, um, this is a very different game to what I signed up for. Okay, you got me. I'm not Lady Maple yet, but I still accept any tribute in the form of snacks. As a soil quality on the old farm, those fields have been fallow a good long while. But they're raring for some crops. Heck yeah, they are. Many insects live in trees. If you give them a little shake, sometimes they'll come out to say hello. That's neat, but I don't have a... I think I need a net to catch bugs. And I don't have one yet, so... Here she is. I've seen, I've seen bits about Henrietta on TikTok. Chicken clucks at you with a real air. You're sure that this must be Henrietta, Hayden's prize winning chicken. Uh, hey chicken. Ooh, it's a good chicken. No, it's a pleasure to meet you, Henrietta. Be nice to the chicken. Henrietta picks the ground indifferently at your blatant attempt to get on her good side. Ugh, rude. Just trying to be nice. Okay, we've met everyone in there. So let's go up to the museum. I don't have anything on me to donate at the moment. We might find some stuff on the way. Oh, okay. I just watered the ladybird. I want to pick it up so bad. I just want to grab it. What is this? A mysterious looking chicken statue. There are shiny beads glinting from the bottom of its container. Hmm. Okay, so stuff for later. Oh, we got another dandelion. We got some berries. I've heard berries are not the best at getting your energy up, so uh, they might be worth keeping for like selling and stuff. A wild leek. Wild plant forage in spring with a pleasant ta taste similar to garlic. Commonly used as a cooking ingredient. Nice. So that's something that we can donate to the museum as we head up them. Anything in the trees? <gasps> a tulip! Yes! Ooh! I can't... I'm too full! No! Let's uh, eat. Eat some of these berries. Yes! Water chestnuts. Ooh! An invasive species brought to Mistria from Wida Aldaria. Used as an ingredient in cooking. Oh no, don't eat. Okay, cool. I'll just take it all. Thank you very much. Do I have anything else? Where is the museum? I feel like I've completely missed it. Or is that it over the bridge? That might very well be it. Come with me, water chestnuts. Thank you, thank you. You see him? There we go, okay. So it was just a straight shot. 
Hi, I already donated something yesterday. Well, welcome. I assume this is about my letter. It is excellent. In my talks with Lord Eland and Lady Adeline, they they entreat me to concern myself with objects from antiquity. Dude, do you have to be so wordy to the person that cannot handle words? <laughs> as well as to use the museum to showcase the many unique specimens of Mystria. To wit, if you could bring me not only your archaeological finds, but also plants, insects, and fish of the region, I believe together we can create a museum that's one of a kind. You want my crops? How dare you? <laughs> Indeed, I will display the items that you donate so that visitors from far and wide can appreciate what Mystria has to offer. I do not think we would be ungrateful. There's a generous reimbursement policy set up by the Historical Society, renowned and all kinds of rewards. Would you like to view the museum tutorial? Uh, yes. I think I already know what I'm doing though, because I did it yesterday. Open the museum menu by interacting with the ledger. Put the items you want to donate into the donation box and hit donate. We'll then see which sets your items went into and how close those sets are to completion. You can check the museum wings at the ledger to see completion, statues and reward hints. Uh, you can check on the item tooltip, see if an item belongs to a set and if you've already donated it or not. That is very handy. I like that feature in games. So what do you say? Can we count on you? Let's get digging! ready for an alarming variety of creepy crawlies. Splendid! As an official surveyor, let me give you a small stipend to welcome you. You're gonna give me money? How much money? Wow, that's actually quite a lot of money, thank you. Okay, what can we donate? We can donate these two. So, spring forage, so we can get all of these at the moment. And then the tulip is from the flowers. So we only need three more flowers, which is quite handy. And then can we not can we not go in wings until we complete them then? I'm guessing. Okay, let's have a look. The two people that we need to meet, are they yes, they're still in town. So let's head into town then. Hi, bye, we just met. Uh, okay, Elsie, we did meet you. Uh, have you met them? Yes, I have. I'm the great aunt born up by blood. Some of us are simply born aunties, you see. Uh, I've spoken to you, yeah. Don't just march by his first impression. Or his second impression. Or maybe his third impression. I guess you've got to judge him at some point. Uh, okay, where are these people? So, across and down. So, seems I'm heading this way, let's head this way. <gasps> A tulip. I can give it to Adeline. Wait, stop! Stop, stop! Landum. Hi there, name's Landum. You must be the one Lady Adeline was telling us about. My nephew, Reese is around your age, taken the lead at the carpenter shop since I retired. We saw everything from crafting stations and furniture recipes to farm buildings and home upgrades. Stop by any time. Oh, look at this big flower. Yes. Oh, he's not one for the museum. Hi, stinky. Rare beautiful red flower, grown in spring, can be given as a gift or used in various crafting recipes. Ah, but it's not for the museum. Let me in, I want to see what is in here. Okay, nobody in here, so I'm guessing that's his son Reese. then? That is in town. Oh, deep woods locked. Uh... Okay, yeah, so Reese is like in the main bit of town. So let's head back. Um... Oh, hi. You know, I admire that you've taken over the old farm. I thought about it myself, but I live too much by the seed of my plants. Um, is. Okay, so Adeline's in 
whatever shop that is. It's going to take me a while to learn what all the shops are, where they all are. Um, so down here. There, Reese. Hi, you must be Gemma, right? Nice to meet you. Welcome to Mystria. I'm Reese. Run the carpenter shop with my uncle Landon. If you have any interest in crafting, let me know. I'd be more than happy to give you some tips. Uh, what kind of crafting? Well, woodworking is my specialty. I'm sure you'll want to make things like fences and furniture for your farm, right? Feel free to use the crafting station near the town square. If you stop by the carpenter shop, you can also purchase some crafting recipes if you like. Anyway, good luck getting settled in. Let me know if you need anything. Nice! So I think this one is the tavern. I think? Yes, this is the inn. So, does that mean we completed our task? Yes! Okay. I did I did it! Turn in my request! Leave everyone in time. That's wonderful. Congratulations on completing your first request. Here's your reward. Nice, we got potatoes! Oh, I can't carry them. Um, tell you what, Adeline. Would you like this gift? For me? Thank you. Nice. Okay, I think I picked up the money. Uh, we'll soon find out anyway. So, if I go into my journal. Be giving her a gift. Oh, I liked gifts. Yes. Yes. Okay, before we head back, are there any more requests before we go and plant them? D do a bro a favour. Welcome to Titan. Have you noticed that Mystery is full of rocks? I've got just the tool for dealing with them and it's all yours if you can do me a favour. Come talk to me for the details. Okay, so we need to talk to Ulrich. Oh yes, I'm getting a pickaxe. Definitely doing that. Keep seeing folks enjoy water chestnuts in all ways, but the best way, deep fried. <gasps> that does sound really good actually. <laughs> I love a water chestnut. If I can put, if there's like a, a stir fry or a sweet and sour and I can put water chestnuts in, you bet your bottom dollar I'm doing it. But deep fried, I've never thought about doing anything like that. Bring me some and I'll enlighten you to the recipe. Bring two water chestnuts to Juniper. Well, we have 13, um, so that's fine. So, where is Juniper? She's up in her shop, so... Let's go take her some water chestnuts. This game is so cute. I'm having so much fun. And I, I still can't believe that I wrote off this game just because of how the gameplay looked. And I'm so glad that TikTok was able to change my mind. It's not good for a lot of things, TikTok, but it was good in this case. Perfect. Here's the recipe. Sometimes I think if I hadn't gone into my uh, bathhouse business... I would have opened a snack stand. A snack stand. I suppose I could still fill my cauldron with cooking oil one of these days. Nice. Okay, water chestnut fritters. I can't do anything with that because I am stinky. Can I eat anything? No. I think it stays there from what I've seen. If you can't pick up stuff, I think it stays. So we'll come back. Uh, those expressions suggest that the bath is extra good today. Nice. Okay. Let's go and plant my potatoes. We'll come back for that recipe. Don't let me forget that it's in the bathhouse. Because I will. And we won't talk to Aldrick yet. Uh, not Ol Aldrick. He's Ulrich, isn't he? He's just... He's just one Rick. Ulrich. He's... Yeah. No old. He's just a Rick. Um, because I have no space. <laughs> For the pickaxe that he wants to give me. So let's go and drop some stuff off. And then we can go back, get that recipe, speak to Ulrich and get a pickaxe as well. <laughs> I want it so bad. <laughs> Just let me pick it up. Okay, so I don't know if it is kind of like Stardew where you have to like, we, we don't have to, but you can sell one of each item uh, for perfection, like to ship every item. So uh, I'm going to do it. Um, I 
It can be given as a gift or used in crafting. And it does say it's rare. I'm going to keep that for now until I come across another one, I think. So let's put these bad boys in. There we go. And then potatoes, right. Where are we going to put potatoes? We've got three again. I suppose I can just do this. What was that? Was I getting like little XP points for doing that? Is that what that was? Yeah, skills. Nice. Okay. I'm getting a little XP. That's a lot of skills. Cool. Okay. Um, right. First things first. I'm going to go... I want it, but I can't have it. Let's go and pick up that recipe because I that will be the thing that I will forget. At least the quest, there's a reminder, but the recipe, I will forget. So let's head back up and grab it. Because with the recipe as well, I think I can just learn it there and then. So it will... What is going on here? If you're new here, so I'll tell you a secret. There's so many adventures in Mistria. What are you doing, Miss Juniper? I'm making a potion of superior night vision. Why do you need a potion of oh, super venison? That's not what she said. Is my dyslexic brain now not working? It'll help me see in the dark. Superly. Why does it smell like that? That's the sulfur. Oh, that's a stinky potion. Are you going to drink it? No. Can I drink it? Tempting, but your mother would absolutely kill me. And she's not already? Okay, use this scroll to learn how to cook the following dish. Water, chestnut, fritters. Learn. Yes. Nice. Oh, water, chestnut, fritters. That does sound good. Okay, now we need to find Ulrich. Uh, I think that's him there in the center. Potentially. Liz. Oh, he needs to be Daddy Hayden. Hi. Remember, I said you came by and said hello. That was thoughtful of you. She's an incredible chicken. What do you mean by she said? We'll, we'll keep him in his little fantasy that the chicken's talking to him. That's fine. No red flag at all. Do a bro a favor. Yes, I would like to do a bro a favor. Thanks for taking my request. Now, where did I put that pickaxe? Oh no, he can't find it. Ah, there we are. So, you must be the blacksmith. Wow, you're incredibly ripped. <laughs> you must be the blacksmith. Just help out around here. I actually used to be a miner. Then the earthquake hit and we had to close the mines. If you want to know more about the mines, you should talk to Errol. He used to be the mines foreman, but he's now our museum curator. I respect him a lot. He's way chiseled. Oh, that's right. I want you to have my old pickaxe. Breaking rocks is a great way of getting toned. It's a little old, but should be strong enough to break small rocks. If you want a stronger pickaxe, you'll have to forge it or buy one from us here. Glad you'll be putting this one to good use. These days, I help out my little brother, bro March, around our family forge. He's a great blacksmith, but, uh, he's a little, well, not, like, great with other people. We noticed. We met him. Ulrich, are you out here? I need... Huh. What are you doing here? Uh, don't you keep up? I'm here by special request. Hi, March. Uh, I'm here by special request. Actually. Oh. If getting a handout from my brother counts as a special request, I'm not sure I'd go bragging about it. Alright, come to my room after you're done seeing Gemma, right? Alright, demanding little so-and-so. Ah, sorry, he uh, doesn't mean it. So, uh, as for my favour, if you could, like, give March a chance, that'd be way cool of you. He doesn't have a lot of friends. I do know March likes rocks. 
And <laughs> this is where I had trouble with my very first Stardew playthrough, is I couldn't figure out how to do some of the stuff in Stardew. So the first thing that I could like properly get that was a gift, for some reason, was the hot peppers. And that is a loved gift by Shane. And if anyone has played Stardew, you all know what Shane is like. And I ended up marrying him the first playthrough that I did. Simply because I didn't know how to craft anything else. I just didn't grow anything else. I don't know. I don't know. I, yeah, I don't know. And I feel like that may be an issue with March. Is a rock might be the only thing that I can get. So it might be a well. I mean, well. Uh, you completed the quest. Nice. We got a pickaxe. Time to do some rearranging. So what do I want? I want sword. Yep. Yeah. Then this, 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 this is done. Oh no! Don't eat the soup. Okay, I thought I, thought I was gonna eat the soup then. I now you just arrived, but I wouldn't get too comfortable. All right, bro. Okay, neat. So, we did that. So I don't think there are any more requests. It is 7pm, so... Most you pride yourself on being welcoming, so don't be shy about saying hello to your neighbours. Everyone's so excited to see someone you're around tired. Uh, freaking March or something. He clearly didn't get that memo. Um... Yeah, I think that's everything that we can do at the moment. So... I think let's head back. Let's clean up a little now that we've got the pickaxe. Let's get rid of some stuff. Wait, hi. I want to say hi to Celine. Hmm. Just thinking that now that we're neighbours, we should get to know each other better, right? You have an air of mystery about you. An air of mystery, eh? <laughs> Oh, no. Oh. There. That took way too long. The joke has been and gone. Uh, anyway, <laughs> back to the farm. I couldn't find... I was like, oh wait, I have the buddhams on my Steam stream deck, but I couldn't find the button fast enough. Uh, okay, we'll take some of these. We'll take some berries. I'll go to the rock. And I have this snack. Can I thunk it up? No, can I? <gasps> I did. Oh, uh, was it one of these as like a little sapling? I think that's what it was. Okay. Rocks! Yay! Some stone. Yeah, I've got quite a bit of energy, so let's like clean up some of the area just a little bit. There we go, and then we'll chop down a little tree. Considering, well, five for a tree, I guess that's not bad. I was like, considering I just took down a whole pumpkin tree. I only got five wood out of it. Ooh, hey! Dried grass that can be used as feed for large animals. Also used in certain crafting. Nifty, okay. I can't pick up the fibre now. I'm too full. There we go. Some of these. I bet this is too. Yeah, my axe isn't strong enough for that. Stop. No more trees. No trees allowed. The sounds are so satisfying. I don't know why, just the like hunk hunk of the, the axe on the wood. It's 
getting late. Well, yeah, it's 12. We're fine. We're still good. Why can I not chop the street? There. Oh, it dropped an acorn. I can't pick it up. I do fall. Okay, we'll do some more of this. And then we'll go inside, put some stuff away, and pick up what's out here. Before heading to sleep. And pickaxe and schlunk. Oh, oh, I'm out of energy. I was like, what's happening? Soup soup. Nice. Oh, nice. And I can pick that up now. Oh, we gotta go to bed. It's 1 30. Go! Pick it up as you go. Run! Oh my god! Quick! Yeah, sleep! Yes! Oh. Made it just in time. Wagon. Well met, mortal. You're the guardian dragon. Huh? This is a weird dream. Guardian dragon. Also... Why is the dragon statue romanceful? Why do I kind of want to attempt it to see what happens? Just, just, yeah. I'm, is it Claudrius? 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 I like Claudrius. Guardian of Mystria. Thank you for repairing my shrine. Ah, I've been asleep since, well, I can't seem to remember exactly. Even now my mind is shrouded in fog. Magical essence has begun to flow again in Mystria. Of that much, I am certain. I ask you to extend your assistance once more, mortal. I need you to collect this essence and offer it at my shrine so that I may regain my strength. I hereby bestow upon you the ability to sense and collect essence. You should find it naturally when going about your daily tasks. Would you like to view the skill perk tutorial? Yes, please. Gather essence from activities such as farming, fishing, mining, and more. Interact with Cloudorus. See, it seems like a change there. Cloudorus? To view the skill perk menu. Water and Pork will sometimes be found stamina used. Oh, nice. Okay, so we get like a nice little perk. I just skill perk with essence to unlock it. Got it. I grow tired. Let's speak again tomorrow at my shrine. I'm honored you can count on me, but I don't want to. You can count on me. Sleep now, mortal. We will speak again soon. Nice. Okay. Oh, nice. We've got 80 for completing lots of quests. That's not bad. Five for one water chestnut. That's pretty good. What's this? Oh, is this renown that we get for it? We don't... Oh, okay. We don't get gold. We get renown. Daddy. I'm learning. Nice! We leveled up the town! Reward available in reward chest next to the request board. Nice! Nice! We got a little hood! Level 3! Heck yeah! More money! Nice! We got another little outfit! Okay, spring day three. Let's have a look. First of all, let's put everything away. Egg on the nut of an oak tree used in cooking and crafting. Sure, you notice the statue, the, st the statue of the bridge. Oh my goodness, the state of the bridge in the time when you arrived. I'd like to introduce you to a group of us that are spearheading a repair plan. Could you meet with us at the bridge? Yeah, sure, we can do that. Okay, let me. Grassy can use as basic seed feed for animals. Nice. Okay, and let's water everything. 
I reach? Oh, yes, I do reach. That's nice. Okay. And let's go and just put these couple things away. Um... I don't know if I need my hoe out and about. I don't think I do. I might leave those behind. Just so I've got my inventory room for the time being. So let's do that. Let's go talk to our little buddy. Lordorus. Ah, greetings, mortal. The time has come for you to begin collecting essence. Essence will appear in the form of small purple, pur purple orbs. <laughs> wow, it's been a long day. Purple orbs as you go about your day. The activities such as farming, fishing, and mining. You'll be sure to find some. Use this shrine when you want to offer your collected essence. In exchange, I'll use my restore power to grant you skill perks. These skill perks will serve to make life easier for you. I grow tired. <laughs> Let us speak again tomorrow. Okay, can I... I can speak to him already. Okay, I have none at the moment, so. That's what we can get at the moment there. Okay. So many things. I'm not going to read too much into these at the moment because I can't get them anyway. So we'll just leave, leave it be for now. We'll come speak to him tomorrow like he suggested. Uh, nice, there's another one of these. Yo, get some berries. I know they don't really do a lot in terms of like stamina or anything, but at the end of the day, they'll always be good to sell. If anything. Um, so we were heading. We'll go check out the request board first, and then we'll head and meet them at the bridge. Hi. Hey. Shrug with a pickaxe is a great way to move any furniture you have placed. I wonder who figured out you could do that in the first place. Yeah, I wonder who took a pickaxe to their furniture and was like, bonk. Hey, it moves. Okay. Oh, yeah, because we've got stuff in here as well. So we have money. We have about 100. And... Got another hundred? Ooh, I'm fitty. Oh, adventurous hood. That's cute. And a little cute outfit. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, let's do like a little... Yeah, we'll match those. And then pants... Have a brown pants. And maybe on this outfit we'll do we'll do a little cape. And we'll save it to a preset. Okay. And then my original outfit didn't save, so we will take off these. Save my original little outfit as a preset. And I do also want to do... Uh, yeah, let's do a cute little dress. Oh, yeah, I kind of like that. Save that one. There we go. Let's, let's have this little outfit for now. Oh, it looks so cute from the back. Request for berries. Oh, dude, you're in luck. That is my jam that I'm collecting. I'm craving something sweet. If you know, if you bring me some wild berries, I'll teach you how to make berries and cream. Uh, so we need to take him five. So is he close by? No, he really isn't. Where the heck is he? Oh, he's all over in the museum. Uh, well, I don't think we have anything for the museum, so let's go up to the bridge, which I think is this way. It might not be. Uh, we'll see. Hi. 
Oh, it's the newcomer. I suppose I should be thankful. I was the newcomer until you arrived. Josephine's got someone new to fuss over. Oh, it gave me an acorn. Um, okay, so is the bridge up here? Yes, it is. Hey, we were just getting started. Adeline, you know I'm up for it, but this is a big project. You can rely on me to keep Mistria supplied with the basics until the construction is done, but I can't work miracles. Without the bridge, I can't get my wagon in and out of town, and there's only so much I can carry on my back. I've allocated all the resources I can for this, but the earthquake relief from the capital hasn't been as robust as we'd hoped for. I've talked it over with the other merchants in town. We're happy to contribute funds. We've, You've got our backing. That's wonderful to hear, Nora. However, with the whole kingdom in dire need of repair materials, we can't afford the inflated prices on the stone and wood we'll need. Sounds like it's my time to shine. Wonderful. I knew you were the right person for the job. Gathering materials locally would definitely speed things up. That farmland of yours is loaded with high quality stone and timber. See, keeping the stone and timber, it was going to come in handy. If you're willing to do the gathering, we can compensate for the materials. By my calculations, 60 stone and 60 wood should be enough. Sounds about right to me. I'm sure you'll come through, and with a repaired bridge, we'll be able to get the Saturday market up and running again. I'll set up a donation box here at the bridge for you to deposit any gathered materials. Come talk to me when you're finished, and we'll begin the repairs. We're counting on you. Okay. Headline, I see another tulip. So we've got that to do, so... Um, do, do, do. So we just need to requisite the deposit the materials. Deposit the materials. So we need a uh, Eland. Where is he? He was in town, I think. Yeah, he's like all the way right at the museum. Okay, let's go speak to him then, and we can take some stuff with us. Uh, I don't think we have anything for the museum, like I said. I think we've donated kind of what we can for now. But it's just a case. We can go over and talk to him. We got all the berries. Hi, guys. Town's nice, isn't it? Friendliness can be a little overwhelming at first, but you get used to it. My bro works really hard. I sure wish he wouldn't. he would rest just as hard. Hi, guys. If any questions about Mistria, I'm your guy. Been living here my whole life and then some. Wait, that's not quite right. <laughs> oh, it's you. You need help with your new garden. Don't bother someone else. I'm busy. Oh, Alright. Just because you're too cool for me. Too cool for school. Um, okay, I probably should actually while I'm here. Let me just collect stuff. Because we need it for the bridge, so we might as well. Um, and then at least if we need to, we can go and get some soup from town. Let's go! Can I, are these decorative stones or can I smash these boys? No, they're decorative stones, okay. Hey, hey! Oh, hey, you're here! Yes, turn in. Oh, the wild berries I asked for. Thank you! Here's my recipe for berries and cream. I hope you like it as much as I do. Neat. I got it! Popular and slightly sweet combination of fresh fruit and cream. Um, yeah, we don't have anything to donate at the moment, so that's fine. So let's chop some trees, chase some bees. Oh god, remember when Animal Crossing was like around and everyone was just obsessed with like that kind of mentality of like chop some trees, chase some bees. 
I had a miss the day that um, Animal Crossing came out because of COVID and everything. It was like, it couldn't have been a more perfect time for that game to come out, to be honest. Ooh, what's over here? We haven't been over this way. The Western Ruins. Interesting. Got any goodies I can have? Yes, you do. As well as a dandelion. <gasps> oh, we need that for the museum. Um... Sure. Let's eat the acorn. I need you. Come with me. Yes. Snowdrop, anemone, 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 mine. And then, okay, so we can't go up there because that's uh, too steep. Ooh. I can't pick this up either. Um, okay. Tell you what. Uh, let's get rid of the dandelion then. Unidentified artifact. A new artifact you don't recognise. You use it to identify what it is. Ancient horn circlet. A rare artifact. A horn circlet from the age of the witch queens. Was this fashion accessory or did it serve a greater purpose? Ooh. We'll have to take that one back to the museum. Okay. Before we do anything else here, we've got two things for the museum, so let's take these back so we can clear up some space. Let's donate them. And then... Oh, that's another thing that I need for the museum. Ish. Um, okay. Oh, I just kicked my ring light, which is also now blinding me, but I don't know if I turn it down. Oh, there we go. That's cosy. That's a bit better. It's now no longer blinding me, and I don't look as ugh, pasty. Uh, I guess let's get rid of this for now, because I'd rather take this lovely daffodil and donate that as well. So we can kind of like donate all the things at once. And then we can go back to the ruins and have a little look around. Dude, have I got some stuff. Blah, blah, blah. Donut. Oh, we're so close to finishing the bundle. Okay, ancient artifacts. Got it. Okay. We just need one more flower and then we're done. So let's head back and see. So those little round patches, I thought you had to have a shovel for those, but clearly not. So those little humps, uh, we can bash with our pickaxe and we'll get stuff. So that's neat to know. Archaeological dig site. So these. Heat. A brick of compressed organic matter, commonly burned as fuel used in crafting materials. And what is this? Ooh, ancient stone lantern. An uncommon artifact, an impossibly delicate stone lantern from the age of the witch queens. It still retains an ethereal glow from within. So cool. I'm so excited to learn like the lore as well about everything. Is there anything else we can hit? Yep. Get some more stone while we're here. Oh, I can't. Yeah, I, I want it, but I can't. It's so sad. There we go. So we've got 10 stones, so we're not doing too bad. Chickpeas, a wild vegetable grown in spring, commonly used as an ingredient in recipes. Okay, so we'll go donate the lantern. And then I guess head back because our inventory is kind of full. And then we can drop off some stuff gather some stone and wood from our farm and 
Okay, donate those two. Dig site material set. Collection of common materials found while digging. Nice, nice, nice. Okay, let's go. Uh, yep, yeah, sure. I'll take you. Okay, Daffy deal. Because, I mean, we can always use them for just gifting to people randomly, even if it's not, like, a loved gift or anything. I suppose it doesn't really matter. We can just give it to people. There we go. How are we doing for energy? We're not too bad. I... I don't want to go drink some soup yet, but I also don't know how long the soup is available for. That's my only thing. Yeah, I hope you catch a good one today. Um, it might be worth... I might go up and get some soup now just before it's too late. Again, I don't know if the inn has like a time it shuts or or not. I don't know. See, because I did the little chime for eight o'clock, and I'm scared. I'm like, is it, can I not do anything? Soup, please. Ooh, minestrone. Yes, please. Ooh, that actually didn't fill me up a whole lot. I thought it was going to fill me up a bit more. But I'm coming along. Folks help out around here, so don't be shy asking. This is so tasty. Your sister's really good at food, guys. Can she be the Dragon Guard's official chef? Well, the Dragon Guard is part of Mistria, and Raina is essentially Mistria's royal chef. So, yes! I like that when they're like all together, it kind of gives you like a dialogue for all of them. I know you're the new farmer and all, but don't get jealous. I'm the one in town who's known for being corny. I've only just moved in town, but I was hoping you'd keep an eye out for Celine since you're just down the road. She only recently moved out to her own place and a mother worries. Oh, no problems. I also saw, no, I saw this purple and I was like, is that the other flower we need for the museum? Because, uh, you bet we'd be going to the museum. Okay, let's go drop off some things and break some rocks. I need to stop overclicking. I need to realise that it counts the kind of like overclick. That's why sometimes it doesn't do I need to get good. Get good, scrub. Nice. And um, wait, I think. <gasps> there, yeah, I can jump. Look at that. Woohoo. Okay, enough jumping. Time for bashing. We need rocks and we need wood. Tree, you're kind of in my way here. You might have to go. Thanks. I think I'm going to chop this way. I don't know if it does kind of count like it does in Stardew, but just in case. <laughs> We're going to cut it from the side that's not by the river. Oh. Okay, we are starting to get a little low on energy now, so we won't be able to do too much more, but it is almost the end of the day anyway, so. Yep, and that is me out of energy. Um, Wait, I can eat some chickpeas. Then give me just a smidge. Pine cone. Nice. Yep, and that's me out of energy. Okay. So let's go put everything away. It's getting late. Do we gotta go? Oh, I didn't even go in my house. Okay, and let 
let's put everything in. There we go. So we're, to be fair, we're not too far off. We're halfway there with um, the stone pretty much. And then we're over halfway with the wood. So that's pretty good. I just whacked my mic. I'm so sorry. If that like reverberated everywhere. Um, okay. So we're on day three. So it's Reese's birthday tomorrow. Um, I guess we could give him like a flower or something. What I might have to do is write this down. Um, just for upcoming stuff because I think uh, what I'll do looking at the time I might cut this one here it was just a short little stream just to get back to things start feels a mystery -er. um, and I don't really want to start a new day because I've got to end soon um, so I don't really want to start a new day and then just leave it so um, we did good proud i'm so happy it's so cute and cozy and it's a lot more fun than i thought it was gonna be so let's do a little bit of this uh let's bring this over here so that i can see it a bit better there we go um yeah i think that is it for the time being um like i said i'm gonna end um the stream now i think just so that like i said i can go i'm not starting a new day but i'm so glad to be back streaming i'm very excited i'm very excited to carry on with fields of mystery excited to do lots of other things as well i'll try and fix the issues with the notifications for next time so if i missed anything if i missed anything in chat i'm really sorry uh it didn't tell me uh but i'll try and sort it for next time so yeah thanks so much for everyone that came to hang out uh had a little cozy stream and i will see everybody next time i guess um yeah i always tend to ramble for these i never know how to end but yeah i'll see you guys later Bye bye